Ready? One, two, here we go. My name is what? I don't know what. Hey, ho, what, whoa. Anyways, hey, so it's Thursday now. Yesterday was the Justin Timberlake concert, like I told you I was going to. And let me tell you the story of how I didn't get scalped or screwed. The story of <laughs> cut, not, but that's the thing is, if I was like any other YouTuber, there would be a hard cut there, and the battery's gonna die. So let's make this video quick. Here's the story of how I didn't get screwed by a scalper. So my girlfriend and I wanted to go to Justin Timberlake yesterday. Also, no, I mentioned my girlfriend, who said I never mentioned anyone else in my life. So, girlfriend, 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 girlfriend. My girlfriend and I were trying to get tickets for Justin Timberlake. Even for working at a radio station, I didn't have any tickets to the show. So, I went to the internet to try to find some. Uh, man, that blinking red light is just saying, I'm going to die, dude. I'm going to die. So, got to make this quick. Uh, guy's like, oh, yeah, come meet me at the mall. So, I'm like, all right, dude, yeah, I'll come. So, the dude, like, took forever to show up. Of course, you're not going to meet, like, in your car because I'm going to take your plate down. Because that's what I was planning to do. Like I said in the last video, I'm like, I'm just going to write down the plate numbers. I'm going to record our conversation. So, I recorded it. I look at the tickets. I'm like, where'd you get these? He's like, I got them from Ticketmaster. I'm like, they mailed you these? And he goes, yeah. I'm like, how can you sold it? Well, Actually, it was going to be like a group thing, but everyone started dropping out, and I didn't want them to go to waste. Yeah, well, maybe they started dropping out because they saw how fake they were. I looked at them like, dude, these are fake. And he goes, really? And I'm like, yeah, really. And he goes, oh. I'm like, well, thanks for wasting my time. He's like, oh, yeah. So eventually we got tickets. Um, I bought them from a guy who pulled up in his car. Um, and the guy, the, the couple sitting next to us also bought their tickets from that guy. So... He had to get rid of the tickets because the kids that he bought them for decided they wanted to be responsible young adults and be camp counselors. So they weren't in the area. So the show was awesome. The battery's going to die. So I'm wondering if I should just talk until the battery dies. I kind of want to just do that, but who knows how long this battery actually lasts. I should probably charge this camera. So many thoughts at one time. What? But Justin Timberlake is the man. You know, it's crazy. Like, he is the new, like guy for guys to have guy crushes on. First it was like Brad Pitt, um, maybe Tom Cruise. I didn't have a Tom Cruise guy crush. No way, that dude's too batshit for me. Uh, but definitely Brad Pitt. Now JT, like the dude does it all. You know, he plays piano, he plays guitar, he can like dance, he can act, he can sing. What can't that guy do? Is he married? Because I was going to say he can't get married, but he can. I think he's married to that Jessica girl. So, also, side note, Chris Kirkpatrick was just hanging out at the bar before the show at like 3 in the afternoon just drinking at the bar, him and his wife, just being kirkpatrick -ing. So, I don't know. <laughs> then he just disappeared. We don't even know if he stayed for the show or he just was like, yeah, I'm going to go to the bar and hang out. Maybe someone will notice me. Maybe. Hey, remember me? I'm Chris Kirkpatrick. I had crazy hair for a bit. Remember? But, so, it was a great show. This whole stage, like, there's this platform that moves across the entire arena. It's like a bridge that goes over the lower level and just went back and forth. It was crazy. Um, I don't believe... Here's another thing. Like, I got my tickets. Yeah, all right, fine. That's fine. I paid money for them. But I got them because I was so worried that I wasn't going to be able to get tickets from anyone that was selling tickets. But then, you know, half hour before the show, I bump into some friends, and they're like, oh, I'm actually trying to sell my extra tickets. And I was like... Uh, and then people were selling them real cheap at the end, but, I mean, I like the seats that we got. We had really good seats. We were, like, in the middle of the arena, so we got to see everything go, going around. So, I'm stoked for that. It was a good show. I had a great time. I'm sorry that I couldn't get my girlfriend better seats. My girlfriend, 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 my girlfriend. The thing is, she wants me to talk about her, but if I ever pointed the camera in her face, she would just freak out. What's with that, girlfriend? I'm just going to, you know what, the new video series is going to be me complaining about my girlfriend. How do you like that, girlfriend?